Hi everyone, my name is Yogesh and I am working as a software engineer at uh, ServiceNow and uh, in this video we are going to talk about how to become a job ready programmer in 3 months and I am going to talk about the same strategy that I followed during my preparation. First of all, we will have to make a clear understanding that uh, 3 months preparation is a myth. 3 months or 6 months preparation is a myth. You need a lot of time. For example, if someone is starting, if someone do not have a prior experience or knowledge of uh, any programming language, then that is next to impossible. But over here, I am considering that if you want to become a job ready programmer, then you are already familiar with data structures and algorithms, but not very good. But at least you are familiar. You are comfortable with arrays, linked lists, tree, graph, these kind of data structures. And if a good command over one programming language, then coming to the projects part. So you do have a good number of projects on like one to two projects. It could be machine learning, web development, Android, data science, anything. And you do have a good knowledge on computer fundamentals such as DVMS, networking, operating system. So coming to the part that how to become a job ready programmer in three months. So I will answer you that, for example, you'll have to decide which company you are appearing for. Consider I'm appearing for Microsoft. Then I would decide, okay, like these are the number of consider I do have full time. So I'm doing at least four questions a day. So at least four questions a day multiplied by 90 days. So 90 days, it's going to give me 360 problems, leave 360. But if even I do 300 top lead code problems. So what you have to do if you are appearing for any product based companies or any company, you'll have to go through the different interview experiences and search for what are the topics or what are the top asked questions for that particular company. You can practice that, right? And then, of course, you should have a good command over uh, computer fundamentals also. But also, it depends company to company. Like, okay, someone is asking operating system. Someone is more focused on networking and DBMS. So you have to decide upon that. So I will suggest you because this is the crucial time and try to give more and more coding contests on either it could be on lead code daily problem, either lead code weekly or bi-weekly contest, or maybe coding in just code studio platform, wherever you can find or compete among the competitors. Because at the final, when you will be giving a online assessment round, then it will really help you to cop up with that pressure. This will be my suggestion for you that how can you prepare for job ready programmer? How can you become a job ready programmer in three months? Get your basics clear, go through the different interview experiences, try to give as much as coding challenges. And of course, try to learn from editorials and uh, blogs as well. Thank you. Hi there. We hope you liked our video and found it useful. We would also like to inform you that Coding Ninjas has come up with a scholarship test called CNSAT. If you participate in the test, you can avail up to 100% scholarship on any course in Coding Ninjas may it be TSA, web development, product companies, interview preparation, data science, or any other course. So click in the link in the description below or the pinned comment and participate in the test. Happy learning, guys. Thank you so much.